Hey guys, we're going to wrap up this series about connecting our spiritual battles to the art of war. Got a minute? So jumping into Sun Tzu, it is easy to love your friend, but sometimes the hardest lesson to learn is to love your enemy. This mirrors a lot of what Jesus says, but I wanted to talk at least from a different angle. I want to connect it to John 8 verse 36. So if the sun sets you free, you will be free indeed. So as believers, we have been set free. We are like in an open field and it goes as far as the eye can see. But sometimes we put restrictions on that freedom that are not meant to be there because of our own offense. See, whenever we become offended, whenever we bring about offense, we build offense in our freedom. If I become offended by something that you do, then I no longer, I, I kind of build this barrier between me and you, and I no longer have the freedom that God set for me. So we have to learn to break down those fences. We have to learn to let go of our offense. Matthew six fourteen says, For if you forgive men when they sin against you, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. So whenever you tear down those walls, there's more freedom freedom for you. Sometimes what that means is that we have to say, hey God, you know, I, I forgive that person. I let it go. Sometimes we have to go to that person and just say, look, hey, you, that, that, that messed me up. That, that frustrated me. That upset me, you know, and I just wanted you to, to know that. And I'm sorry that I was holding a grudge against you. Yes, that means you might have to swallow your pride in order to apologize to the person that hurt you. But guess what? It's about your freedom. Do you have any fences up? Any boundaries and borders of people that you can't connect with because you're holding on to an offense. Be like Christ and break down fences and allow freedom in your life. Thanks for taking a minute.